Beautiful people, do you love this green man? Because I do. And that's why in today's video, we added dream mode into Minecraft. Hey, Dream, if you're watching this and you want to film it with me, let me know. Zombies in Dream Mode have Sapnap as their skin and the name tag above them, and they're also extremely fast and way more deadly than regular zombies. Take okay, that. really, man? At the beginning of the video. Dude. This has got to be a reference from one of their videos, but pigs now will fly. If I release this pig from underneath this tree, it will begin levitating. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this pig in the distance. And when they fall, they don't take any damage. They just levitate again over and over again. You know that saying? It's like when pigs fly. If you believe pigs should fly even in vanilla Minecraft, leave a like on this video. That would just be great. Okay, so wait, hold on. This is really sick. If you type event start, random events will happen on the server like meteor showers, random falling anvils, creepers, you name it. It's crazy. We'll, we'll see more of that throughout the video. Typing timer slash start starts a speed run timer at the top. And if you you die it automatically resets look at that look at that hey it resets if you want to see me attempt to speed run in a later video let me know down below in the comments and who you want to see me do it with i'm pretty sure this is one of the random events that's happening it's a tornado oh uh, that was surprising check this out you can actually craft a dream npc using golden apples diamonds and emeralds you get the dream bot place this guy down and you got dream in your minecraft world there is one problem though he just follows you over and over again and punches you oh no not another event stop it stop it Listen, Dream, we could talk about this. I don't know if he's killable. I'm going to see. Does he take damage to lava? Oh, he does. He does. Let's go. <laughs> that is the only time you will ever witness me killing Dream. There will be no other time. Only if Dream is an NPC is the only time I stand a chance. So, okay, this is kind of interesting. Stone does not drop cobblestone. Instead, it will drop oak logs, which, to be honest, is a little bit overpowered. I mean, look at this. I would prefer for this to be in vanilla Minecraft, but to contrast this, punching trees will drop cobblestone. Look at that. So weird, dude. <laughs> I don't know if I want to live in this Minecraft world where trees are giving me cobblestone. Look at this. Stop it. Okay, dude, the same random event has happened to me three times now. It's always the tornado. Yeah, I feel like punching trees and getting cobblestone is not the most useful thing, but we made it anyways. Don't ask why I've got an arrow in my head. This is highly unethical, but if you did want to cheat in your speed run, eat Eating golden apples reduces the timer of the speed run by 15 seconds. So basically, we can reverse our speed running time by just munching on golden apples. If there's one thing in Minecraft I think I can beat Dream at, it's parkour. I will admit he's insane at it, but now strongholds have parkour to get into them. Instead of having to find them with an eye of ender, it gets repetitive. So instead, we thought it'd be way more interesting if the strongholds had parkour that you had. Dad gummit, dad gummit. Oh, what would you? <laughs> okay, wait, look at this. All right, this is one of those random events where actually that just helped me do the parkour in the stronghold, so I'm not even mad, though. Oh, yeah, look at that. Easy peasy parkours are squeezy. Minecraft, if you're watching this video, please add parkour into the stronghold. This is so much better. Am I the only person in the Minecraft community that likes parkour? I just love it. But the parkour is very dangerous. You got cobblestone fences you got to jump on, iron fences with head-hitting jumps. Stay I don't even know where this, where is the stairs? But look at it. You get to the end and you can place in your eyes of and you can get to the end. So much more convenient. Furnaces are now pre-lit inside of dream mode, which means they always have a piece of coal inside of them. And brewing stands also have blaze powder inside of them. A lot of you probably don't remember, but in the beta version of Minecraft, food did not replenish your hunger. It actually just gave you health. So now in dream mode, the hunger bar always stays full. But if you take damage, you can use food to just replenish your hearts directly. It's so much better this way. Technically, you can just continue eating. Oh, that's a random creeper spawning. Thank you, creeper. Bro. Why are you trying to ruin my dream mode video? <laughs> that creeper that killed us actually broke the server and now I've got to reset it. <clears throat> Thank you, creeper. <laughs> In dream mode, compasses are overpowered. The only thing you need to use the eyes of Ender on is to open up the end. That's it. But you can find a stronghold by using the compass. I don't know how long it's going to take, but I'm going to try. Okay, we're, we're flying. We're zooming. Is this? Wait, is what is this? Oh my god, dude. The stronghold is 7,000 years away. Does this actually work? Oh, it does. Oh, it does. Oh, oh. Okay, if the compass is correct, the stronghold's directly beneath us. Hey, dog, it actually works. That is actually amazing. 
Oh, okay, this is cool. So, <laughs> if there's a clock in an item frame, you can... Oh, stop it! Not again! Oh, jeez! Trying to show off a feature. Anyways, as I was saying before I was rudely interrupted... If you have a clock in an item frame and you right-click it, it sets the time to the opposite of what it currently is. So, if it's daytime and you right-click it, it's nighttime and daytime and nighttime and daytime and nighttime and nighttime. I think you get it. You know what else is pretty cool? Hitting that subscribe button if you haven't already. Do it or I'll dab. Nobody wants to see that cringe, so subscribe. I don't think this is fair, but in the nether, your timer is twice as fast. So every second in the nether adds two seconds onto your speedrunning timer. However, the loot is insanely overpowered in the nether, and all you have to do, like with strongholds, is parkour. I mean, you gotta admit, dude, this is pretty cool. Like, if stop it, random events. You guys are the bane of my existence. Actually, you just helped me parkour, so thank you. But imagine this, in a world where all you have to do is parkour in the nether to get full diamond gear, baby, sign me up like a tomato. Fry with basil. I mean, this is sick. That's a big jump for mankind. Ha <laughs> just kidding, get out of here, pigment. Yeet! This is, oh my god, okay, seriously? <laughs> we might have got a little too overpowered in the nether for dream mode, but I mean, it is dream. Oh, uh, yeah, I forgot to mention, um, instead of piglins, we have George not found skins. That's also another random event that just struck me with a <laughs> Hello, George! Can I make a trade with you? I have gold! Oh, this one's got a- Oh my gosh, this one's got a golden helmet and a crossbow. Yeah, you like that, George? Oh, look at you like, George, look at this! George likes the gold! <laughs> Come on, George. Make the trades. Make the trades. Oh, yeah, yeah, look at this! Oh, look at that! George gave me glowstone dusts, and I got nether bricks. Alright, we are about to find out which George is the most generous. Three of them have gold ingots. Oh, soul sand from George number one, soul sand from George number two, and then string from George number three. George number three is the most generous. Thank you, George number three. When I sneak, there's an outer glow on every single hostile or passive mob. Can you stop it with the random events? Okay, what, <laughs> what just happened? The anvil just literally made me sit down. Ska. Oh no, 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 I've angered the Georges. And because everybody thinks Dream cheats, we have the built-in wall hack. When you sneak, you can see passive and hostile mobs like this, George. Hello, George, don't shoot me. Why, why are you doing this? Why, don't be like this, George, please. He hello, what's wrong? I don't know why. Noob1234 has joined in the nether. No, no, noob, you are not a speedrunner. Stop it, you're not, stop. Noob, listen man, Noob gets pretty excited about the videos. He thinks he's a speedrunner. You're not a speedrunner. I'm sorry, you never will be, sorry. <laughs> he just, <laughs> oh, that's See a nice you, touch. He logs out, that's great. Okay, listen, before I show you what's next, just know I love bad boy Halo. Okay, I love him, but <laughs> But in dream mode, blazes are now bad boy halos. I love you, bad boy. Okay, I know you're probably gonna call me a muffin. Listen, you're a beautiful muffin man, but I got... <laughs> Somebody had to be the blazes, and it and your skin looks the most like a blaze. For what it's worth, the blazes are epic. They shoot like a ton of fireballs at once. I'm a little salty, bad boy halo. I sent you a DM October 13th, a week ago, and you still haven't responded. Do I... Do I smell bad? Is that what it is, man? Fun fact, if you mine ores in dream mode, it reduces your speed running timer. You can literally even go into the negatives. The better the ore you mine, the more the timer gets reduced. So if you mine diamonds, you get like five seconds off your timer. It's pretty sick. Don't ask why, but when you equip a full set of golden gear, you get jump boost three. Why? I, I don't, I, I don't know. Okay, we thought it would be cool to add, so we did it. It doesn't have to make sense, guys. It's dream mode. But if you put on a full set of diamond gear, you actually get slowness three. This is terrible. <laughs> Ain't no way you're speed running in full diamond gear like this. So it's better if you can mix and match gear. Don't wear full diamond in dream mode. It's bad. I think this one's a little strange, but if you kill a mob using a golden sword, it loads the mob onto your head. You can throw it as a projectile and it explodes. <laughs> Dream mode. <laughs> this is the moment you've all been waiting for, ladies and gentlemen. We are finally at the end. The end in dream mode is very interesting. You have three NPC speedrunners, Sapnap, George, and Bad Boy Halo. And you've got to eliminate all three of them before you can even start to deal damage to the Ender Dragon. I don't know why, but I feel like the NPCs are running faster than I am. Thankfully, the NPCs don't attack back, so you're fine. The biggest thing you have to worry about is the Horde of Endermen. <laughs> I got my dice. Stop it, Enderman. Stop it. Can you leave me alone? I literally know how they feel now when they're hunting Dream and they have Enderman just 
destroying them from the back. It's not enjoyable. It's, <laughs> it is literally anything but enjoyable. All right, George, George, you're a handsome man. Come here. You're a handsome man with a handsome accent, but I got to take you out to a nice seafood dinner. Come here. Enjoy where you go. <laughs> I thought he was gonna jump off the edge for a second. I was like, don't do it. Literally, stay off my back, Enderman. Stay off. Stay off me, bro. You can't even hang. He can hang. I don't know if anybody noticed the detail that bad boy has no armor. I don't know if this is something that normally happens in dream speed runs, but he's just got no armor on. Finally, we have eliminated the three speed running NPCs. This is when you can finally start to destroy everything. Oh, there we go. Come on, come on. Let's go. Oh my god, no! I do not ever remember the Ender Dragon having these capabilities. So the Ender Dragon in dream mode, of course, has to be massively overpowered, as you can see. He's basically impossible to kill. I'm literally cheating. I've got god mode on and I'm flying and I still can't finish him. You know what? I don't even care. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you beautiful people for watching this video all the way through. You guys rock. Take care and I'll see you all in my next video. Stop it, random events.